I am Dr. O.K. N. Vaikun Trajo. I am a pediatric neurologist from Bangalore. Currently, I am working at Indira Gandhi Institute of Child Health, Bangalore. I also visit at Sagar Hospital, Jayanagar and Claudine Hospital, Jayanagar. And in my clinic at Vijayanagar Child Health Neurology and Rehabilitation Center. Syringomelia, it is, I told it is one type of spinal dysrhabism. The manifestation of syringomelia depends on uh, which part of the spinal cord is involved. Usually, if it is involved in the cervical cord, the upper part of the spinal cord, where there will be weakness in the upper limbs or it may be an involvement of uh, ulcers or non-healing ulcers and there is a loss of uh, sensation, pain and test sensation over the fingers and uh, hands also, where they will have uh, sometimes uh, causing burns and also causing non-healing ulcer. Sometimes it is not treated, it can cause the involvement of bone with osteomyelitis and they will be having difficulty in doing work. Or if it is the involvement of the lower part of the spinal cord, there will be manifestations similar to upper limbs in the lower limbs, they wear non-healing ulcers, weakness. And if it is severe problem, they may have a ball and bladder involvement, like they may not be able to tell a urinary problem and a bowel bladder, bladder problem also. So most of the times they will be associated with non-healing ulcers and it may not cause any pain also, but parents may not be able to know, you need to detect and treat appropriately.